from downtown Detroit, Local 4 News at 6 starts now. It was the site that had everybody pulling out their cameras. Oh my goodness. The Canterbury Village dinosaurs spreading a little cheer on this Thursday afternoon. I'll have that story coming up. Well, before there were even vehicles or even roads, dinosaurs had to walk to get around. Now there's yeah. a segue, Karen. <laughs> uh, today, dinosaurs were spotted roaming in Royal Oak, making their usual loud noises, but also managing to make some new friends. Tim Pamplin among them. It was a beautiful afternoon at Beaumont Hospital in Royal Oak as patients from the children's ward come down have a meet and greet with one of the dinosaurs from Canterbury Village. A six-year-old Helen there in the red shirt doesn't quite know what to make of it. Then she plucks up the courage. Helen's being treated for leukemia. Her mum says this was a welcome break. It's kind of boring just sitting in a hospital room all day, so this was something she could look forward to. The Canterbury Village dinos have been on a charm offensive lately, spreading good cheer. Today we're at Delta Kelly out in Rochester and they have a special needs uh, section of the school and they had a young lady that uh, doesn't respond to anything and today she was dancing and trying to talk when the dinosaur was there and basically brought the whole uh, adult crowd to tears today and you know doing stuff like that that's what it's all about. It really is spreading cheer. One Tyrannosaurus Rex at a time. Little six-year-old guy in here. This is one hospital moment he will be happy to remember. That's the scene at Beaumont this afternoon. Tim Pamplin, Local 4. And I think to mix up the day and, and see a dinosaur. Dinosaurs just have this amazing hold, right? On the young mind. It's really, it's, it's always curious. really cool. Yeah, I love it.